Hello everyone, welcome to another Math Geometric Olympiad problem. Uh, in this Math Olympiad problem, we can find the perimeter of this right triangle. Uh, as we know that uh, the perimeter is the sum of all boundaries of any triangle or any square or any uh, rectangle and in uh, circle uh, the, there will be a circumference. So uh, in this right triangle we find the perimeter of this right triangle as noted the perimeter perimeter will be equal to the sum of all boundaries which is 11 plus n plus m. So we know that the one side will be 11 and other two side will be the variable m and n we do not know y the value of m and n. So we can find this uh, two values uh, as we know that uh, the side AB will be equal to 11 and the side BC which is equal to m and the side AC which is equal to n. So uh, in, uh, in this side there, there is a right triangle so uh, the angle uh, right angle A P C which is equal to 90 degree. So we use Pythagorean theorem to find the value of uh, unknown terms M and N. So we know that the Pythagorean theorem will be equal to uh, the hypotenuse uh, square uh, which is equal to the base square and the perpendicular square. So uh, we use the Pythagorean theorem which is equal to n square which is equal to m square plus 11 square so we use the, this uh, theorem to find the value of n m n n m so uh, we uh, rearrange this term to one side so we uh, cancelling these two terms so we can subtract minus uh, m square and minus 11 square or minus m square on both sides so minus m square minus m square so these two term will be cancelled so we have left uh, in this side uh, n square minus m square which is equal to 11 square so uh, in this term uh, we know that a square we can use the formula a square minus b square which is equal to a plus b a minus b we use n minus m which is a minus b and a plus b which is n plus m which is equal to 11 square 1 11 121 so uh, we our main aim is to find the value of n and m so we uh, compare this term to this term so we uh, first we write the uh, this 121 to their factor form so we know that 121 which is equal to uh, we uh, write the factor of 121 which is 1 multiply 121 which is equal to 121 and 11 multiply 11 which is equal to 121 these two factor we can write in the place of 121 so we are writing n minus m n plus m which is equal to 1 multiply 121 or we can use 11 multiply 11 if we use uh, these uh, two factors 1 multiply 121 so if we compare uh, these two terms no and if we compare this uh, 1 multiply 121 as factor of 121 so uh, n minus m which is equal to 1 and n plus m which is equal to 1 21 uh, we find if we find uh, this the uh, value of n and m we use uh, the uh, uh, in this term we can use the elimination or substitution uh, substitution method or any uh, matrix uh, Kramer rule or matrix inversion method also can be used to find the value of n and m so we add these two terms uh, then we uh, left 2n if we add these two terms we left 2n which is equal to 121 and the value of n uh, we can divide 2 on both sides uh, the value of n will become equal to uh, this will, it will be equal to 122 
because we can add these two terms so uh, and the value of n will become equal to 61 if we have the value of n if we put the value of n in this equation uh, we uh, have n which is equal to 61 minus m which is equal to 1 so our value of m which is equal to 60 60 and n will be equal to 61 if we use uh, the l1 multiply l1 as a factor of these uh, 121 if we use this term so n minus m which is equal to l1 and n plus m which is also equal to 11 if we add these two term we know uh, 2 n which is equal to 22 and n will uh, become equal to 11 if we put the 11 in this term so we have m which is equal to 0 so this term will be rejected because our m which is not uh, be equal to uh, 0 uh, because if we put the value of m as 0 then our uh, equation will be uh, incorrect so this uh, uh, this side will be uh, this two factor will be uh, rejected so our value of n and m will be uh, 61 n n uh, will be equal to 61 and m will be equal to 60 so uh, the perimeter which is equal to n 11 plus n plus m which is equal to 11 plus n which is equal to 61 plus m which is equal to 60 so our perimeter will be equal to uh, total uh, perimeter will be equal to uh, if we uh, this term we uh, have 132 is our perimeter so this is our final answer